Okay, what we have here is a sample of two different um, variables. So I'll read it for you, it may be a bit hard to see. One number is five more than another number. Their sum is 43. Find the numbers. Okay, now as with my all dictionaries, I'm going to begin with the word let. Okay, and I like you starting with a smaller number. So let the smaller number B, and I can use anything I want. I don't want to use S because it looks too much like a 5, so I'll call it N. Now translating this part, this one is number is 5 term. more than Top another number, the words added to so larger is 5 plus more than smaller. Subtracted from difference of okay, so I say left. Minus sign, but if it does say larger five than a number, you have to translate it in reverse. B Times five product of more than smaller. Cross the sign, the okay, so whenever I see the word smaller, five I'm going to translate it as n. Whenever I see the word larger, half of I'm going to translate it as 5 plus n. Translated as multiply. Okay, let, here's my translation. It says their sum is 43. And, so smaller uh, is equals to which I translate as n. Is translated with the equal sign. Plus. And the words which total I translate as plus are translated as I've done larger, set up there. Which I translate as five plus n that comes up is video that comes which up I translate as equals and forty-three. Now it's just a matter of solving. Remember that's the same as one n and one n. So I have two n plus five is forty-three. Take the 5 to the other side. 2n is 43 minus 5. 2n is 38. Divide by 2, divide by 2, n is 19. Now please remember you have two unknowns, not one. So you have to go back and find the other answer. Okay, so the other answer, if you go back up here, it tells you right there in your setup how to find your other answer. Take 5 and add it to n. So 5 plus n is 5 plus 19 is 24. So my numbers are 19 and 24. And you would do a check. So I've got a check here. There are my two answers and they should add up to 43. 9 and 4 is 13, carry a 1, and we get 43. So my answer is correct. I give myself a happy face. Then you should finish off your question by writing out in words the numbers are 19 and 24. Okay? Please remember that uh, when you are finished uh, a word problem, you must have both answers if you have two unknowns.